All right, all right, all right. Let's do it again. All right, do you see that cute little rubber ducky? Do you see that cute little rubber ducky? Well, let me tell you the story behind it. So I love cheeks. I love cheeks. They are, to me, so cute. And I especially love the Wranglers. They just like look this. amazing to me sitting up high and, you know, coming all, you know, you see them, like any car, they come, come in all colors. I also like those Broncos. Those old Broncos that they redo that kind of resemble Jeeps back in my day, back in the 80s. The Broncos and the Jeeps kind of look alike, they kind of look similar. And, um, I like them too, the way that they, that they restore them. Sorry, y'all. The way that they restore them. But I'm happy to tell you about this. Okay, so one day I was coming out of a store, and there was this Jeep parked next to my car, and it had a duck. It had a duck in the handle. And I'm like, what is that? And so about that time, I sat there, and I'm like, you know, I hope ain't nobody, you know, you know, doing anything crazy or, you know, what have you. And about that time, she, the person had dark tinted windows, so I didn't see the other ducks in the, inside the car. I couldn't see inside the car. I, in fact, I didn't even go over too close to it. I was getting in my vehicle. But there, the duck was, not this duck, but a duck like this was, and it was different. It was a white duck with a, anyway, it was wedged in the door handle. And so about that time, the lady and her son was walking up. And I'm like, did you see that? Somebody put a duck in your door handle. And she's like, oh, yeah, haven't you not heard? And I'm like, no, I haven't heard. She said some lady uh, was trying to get a park, and she had a Jeep. And somebody parked too close to her, or she couldn't get in. That the, the two cars were parked too close or something. And anyway, it became a long story about, you know, ducks. And so I, I hope I got the story right, but this is what she was trying to tell me, this young lady that was driving her Jeep. And she was like, after that, uh, this lady started giving, like, you've been ducked. She put ducks and all, you know, she, she brought ducks and she kept them with her. And anytime she would see a Jeep, she would put a duck, you know, on their vehicles and let them know they've been ducked. And so it become a very popular thing. And I actually need to do some history, some homework and, and Google, you know, I'm not saying that what that lady's told me is wrong. It's been some months ago that I heard this, and I've kind of forgotten how the story went. I'll be honest with you, I've kind of forgotten exactly how the story went. But just so you know, that lady, <coughs> excuse me, that lady herself, after she, um, she's like, it's no problem. You know, that's what we do. That's what Jeepers do. And she was telling me how it started. It was from some lady from another country. And she, um opened her car door up. She said, see, I bought some. I keep them and I give them to people. And she had all these ducks lined up across the uh, dashboard of her vehicle. I could see it once she opened the car door. Uh, because, she, again, she had tinted windows and I couldn't see it prior to. But now when I ride around, or now I don't ride around right now. I don't have a car right now. But before, when I was driving and rode around, I would see Jeeps and I would see all these ducks in there. Different little ducks. So whenever you see a Jeep, or a person driving a Jeep, and they have a lot of little toy rubber ducks in their Jeep, do not think it's strange. <laughs> it is a part of their Jeep Wrangler culture. <laughs> uh, not the Jeep Grand Cherokees or the Jeep Renegades, but the Jeep uh, Wranglers. And so here we are. Hey, Jeeper, you've been ducked we hope this duck gave you a smile take a photo and share pound duck duck jeep hashtag duck duck jeep hashtag ducking jeeps facebook and instagram so i wanted to share this whole thing with you so when you walk when you see a jeep and you see all these different style ducks you'll know in this particular duck this little rubber duck has glasses on they, they, they some have some of them have different characters so i was trying to see but she gave me this one and i decided to keep it because one day one day soon i might own me a bronco ha, 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 ha. a beautiful old bronco or a jeep yes and i'll be able to get ducks <laughs> i'll give out ducks i love this love this uh, i think when a person buys a jeep Jeep ought to give them a whole bunch of these 
so they can they can have, build that camaraderie with other jeepers anyway that is so cute all right I actually also remember a town that has um, a duck race in their river. They put in all these rubber ducks and they put numbers on them. And you you purchase one of the ducks as like a raffle or something or, or some type of fundraiser. And then the ducks go down the river and whoever gets there first, whichever number on whichever duck gets there first, wins the cash prize. <laughs> anyway, though, this was about jeeps, 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 jeeps. And when you see them with their rubber duck what it means i don't know i don't know how i feel about this you've been ducked could that mean that you've been ducked like i don't want to see you like we like i'm i ducked you <laughs> I, I i um uh you're not what you're not my cup of tea you're not what i'm interested in so i'm ducking you you know maybe it has two different meanings maybe there's another secret or hidden meaning to it <laughs> maybe it means you've actually literally been ducked like like, you're not my cup of tea, and I don't want you. Oh, you're just a little duck mouth with little duck lips. <laughs> That's me. Isn't that cute? <laughs> All right. Bye. <laughs> Peace. I haven't been duck. I'm going to own me a Jeep one day. And look at this duck. It's got the little Jeep grill in the front. Owe me a Jeep one day. I think a Jeep is a ex nice extra vehicle. I don't know if it's an everyday vehicle. And I love those Broncos too. Y'all got to check out those old fashioned Broncos. But anyway, if you are a Jeep owner, you it's your duty. I started to say something I heard Samuel Jackson say, say on a movie. <laughs> Lord have mercy on um. Uh, on the movie Shaft, the the remake of Shaft, because you know the old 70s Shafts were out years ago, but they remade Shaft. Doom, 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 doom. They remade Shaft, and I think they got like three series of the remake Shaft. One with uh, the rapper in it. Um, can't think of his name. Busta Rhymes. He's in the first one. I think he's also in the second one. Uh, and then there's a third one with the younger guy where he has a son and he's like Shaft Jr. if that makes any sense. Uh, they're all Samuel L. Jackson though, all three versions. The, the, the ones before that were in the 70s and I forget the guy's name, but he's also in the, the second two. Uh, actually, he's in the second three, the newer versions that came out in 2000. Anyway, y'all be blessed. If you own yourself a Jeep, don't get ducked. <laughs> don't get ducked by your future lover don't get ducked by the future relationship that God has for you don't get ducked being rude and, and taking up too much parking space uh, don't get ducked because you can't stay focused don't get ducked because you didn't do the work you don't have the kingdom keys don't get ducked because you are uh, ignorant don't get ducked because you're arrogant. Don't get ducked because you're narcissistic. Don't get ducked because you're too controlling. Don't get ducked because you're hateful. Don't get ducked because you're evil. Choose kindness. Kindness is the new cool. Don't get ducked because you are afraid. Ah, Jesus, that's my problem. Don't get ducked because you're full of fear, huh? Uh, even fear is self-arrogance. Even fear can be foolishness and arrogance and narcissistic. Don't be ruled by fear. Uh, don't be ruled by fear. Don't be ruled by fear, but be ruled by faith. Walk by faith and not by sight. Don't get ducked when you're born for greatness. Don't get ducked because somebody loves you. Somebody needs you. Somebody wants you. Somebody wants to lay beside you. Somebody wants to hold you. Somebody wants to share. Share your world. Share their world. Share your world with them. Somebody wants you. Somebody needs you. Uh, you're a pretty cool kid. Huh? You're pretty cool. Don't get ducked. You're beautiful. Just like you are. You're beautiful. You're born for this. Don't get ducked. Quack, quack. <laughs> Shacky, ducky, quack, quack. Uh, that was a comedy back in the day. Don't get duck. There's greatness on your life. There's greatness in your life. There's greatness for you. Don't get duck. Don't miss it. Don't get duck. Don't miss it. Don't get ducked. Oh, God. Don't get duck. You are fabulous. You're beautiful. You're handsome, you're strong, you got potential, 
you got a rubber, you got a duck's back. You got